2020 was an awesome year for Tesla, the company that started off with the grand and unrealistic master plan of changing the entire landscape of transport across the world, finally emerged as the most valuable automaker in the world. Tesla won over millions of new fans by delivering on its promises and expanding rapidly across the globe. Many of the skeptics who used to mock Elon's plans accepted the incredible rise of Tesla and are now making predictions about its future. The traditional automakers that used to think of Tesla as a non-entity just a few years ago finally woke up to the reality of Tesla moving towards industry domination. They realize that they're left way behind in the grand EV game. 2021 promises to be another incredible year for Tesla. Elon Musk has plenty of amazing plans to make this year a game changer, not just for Tesla, but also for the automotive industry in general. In this video, we'll be taking an in-depth look at Tesla's plans for 2021. Now, before we get started, make sure you like the video to show your support. Also, do subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon as well so you can continue watching such informative tech-focused videos right here on Tech Charge. All right, now let's take a look at Tesla's plans for 2021. First, let's go through some updates expected on the current lineup of Tesla's cars, and then we'll be listing various new vehicles that Tesla has planned to launch in the next few months. After that, we'll be taking a look at the production facilities, battery technology, robo-taxis, and of course, Tesla's expected valuation by the end of 2021. The current lineup of Tesla vehicles is pretty solid. All the cars seem to have a huge demand, and they stack up pretty well against the competition. Tesla has also done incredibly well with regards to ramping up production of the new vehicles. The company looks all set to hit targets of producing half a million vehicles in 2020. During 2021, Tesla will be delivering a lot of Model 3s and will also be accelerating the delivery of the Model Y. According to some reports, Tesla aims to manufacture around 250,000 Model Y cars in 2021. European and North American consumers may be able to get the Chinese-made Model Y cars. The previous models, Model S and Model X, are going to have newer versions that will absolutely blow your mind in terms of performance. The new Model S will be able to go from 0 to 60 miles an hour in less than 2 seconds, and it'll have a range of 520 miles. Now, this model will sell for around $140,000. Being a high-end car, it will not enjoy the same numbers as the Model 3 in terms of sales, but it will make a significant impact in its category. A newer version of the Model X is also in the cards. It may be able to go from 0 to 60 miles an hour in less than 2.6 seconds. Also, the new Model X will have a better infotainment system that many users have demanded from Tesla. Other than that, of course Tesla will be rolling out plenty of software updates with enhanced features for existing customers as well. So yeah, 2021 looks really bright for the Model 3, Model S, Model Y, and Model X. Now we come to the most exciting news for the car enthusiasts around the world in general, and Tesla fans in particular. The launch of new Tesla cars in 2021. Well, obviously, Tesla has done pretty well up until now. But if it's to dominate the global transportation landscape, it'll have to launch many new vehicles catering to all segments of society. This is exactly what Tesla plans to do. First off, Tesla vehicles are still quite expensive. Even the Model 3 starts at about $38,000, which is just a bit too high for the majority of consumers who belong to the middle class and lower middle class segments of society. In January 2020, Elon Musk confirmed that Tesla will be launching a new compact car that will be designed in China and will be sold all over the world. This was followed by a design render of this compact car. Now, while there's still no confirmed news, there are rumors that it'll be called the Tesla Model C or the Tesla Model 2. It'll have a price tag between $23,000 and $28,000. This will obviously make Tesla affordable for millions more of consumers around the world. In 2021, we can expect more news on this vehicle and maybe Tesla to show off a model in one of its events, which will obviously be followed by pre-bookings. The production and delivery of this compact Tesla car may not happen in 2021 and we'll probably have to wait until 2022 or 2023. However, what we don't have to wait that long for is the Tesla Cybertruck. Yeah, the futuristic alien-looking pickup truck that was unveiled by Elon Musk in 2019. It already has more than 750,000 pre-orders, and its deliveries will be starting off in 2021. So get ready to see plenty of Cybertrucks charging down the roads of the US in 2021. Other than that, 
Of course, Tesla has plans to disrupt the trucking industry as well, and the Tesla Semi is going to be the company's first entrance into that segment. The deliveries of the Tesla Semi will start in the U.S. in 2021. Just to recap, this awesome electric truck is capable of reaching 0 to 60 miles an hour with a load of 80,000 pounds in less than 20 seconds. It will be available in two variants, having a range of 300 miles and 500 miles. Tesla also has plans to enter the passenger high-density urban transport vehicle segment. While we may not see a Tesla bus or anything in 2021, we may see a Tesla electric van. Tesla may use the vehicle in the boring company tunnels under Los Angeles as well. According to some reports, the electric van will be able to seat 12 passengers, and of course it'll have the usual Tesla features like autonomous driving, high speed, crazy acceleration, and other futuristic features. Now, if you guys remember, the crazy Tesla revolution started off with a car known as the Tesla Roadster. It had crazy speed, great acceleration, and was a very cool sports car. Tesla is bringing the Roadster back, and you can expect its production in 2021. The second-generation Roadster will be the quickest production car ever. It will be able to reach 0 to 60 miles an hour in 1.9 seconds, which is absolutely insane. It's expected to have a top speed of 250 miles per hour and a range of 620 miles. Now let's talk a little bit about Tesla's plans for its Gigafactories during 2021. The Shanghai Gigafactory has performed superbly during 2020, and it's expected to take the lead in 2021 as well. Tesla aims to produce more than half a million cars in the Shanghai Gigafactory during 2021. Tesla has already issued the ordering requirements to its core component suppliers. While the Shanghai Gigafactory will continue to cater to the demands of the Chinese market, it will also be producing vehicles for export to other regions. European consumers can expect to receive Chinese-made Model 3 cars. Tesla has already fulfilled the certification requirements for export to Europe. Next up, we have the Gigafactory Berlin. While it's had a few issues with respect to environmental concerns, Tesla seems to be dealing with the issues pretty well. The massive Gigafactory Berlin is expected to be the most modern and futuristic Tesla factory upon its completion. It's expected to start production of the Model Y in 2021. Tesla has also announced a product design center in Europe. Another area where Elon will be focusing in 2021 is to get the Gigafactory Texas up and running. This new factory spreads out on a vast area of 2,000 acres, and it looks a lot like the Nevada Gigafactory. Tesla will be manufacturing Model 3s, Model Ys, Cybertrucks, and semis here. During 2021, Elon Musk may also unveil Tesla's plans for the construction of new Gigafactories in the coming years. While Tesla is already pretty set to start robo-taxi services in the U.S., it seems that it may take a while until all the regulatory issues get resolved. The autonomous Model 3 vehicles will be able to provide effective, convenient, and time-saving taxi services to millions of users across the U.S. However, rules and regulations are still a major hurdle and the robo-taxis may take a while to get all over the roads in all states. Tesla is hopeful that it'll be able to roll out a few robo-taxis in major cities across the U.S. during 2021. So this will be pretty much the start of a new era. Tesla will be taking on Uber and other ride-hailing services through its fleet of autonomous vehicles. It wouldn't be wrong to say that if things go well for Tesla, Uber and other companies may face similar situation to that being faced by many auto manufacturers competing against Tesla. Although a lot was expected in terms of battery technology during 2020, Elon Musk didn't announce any major breakthroughs. Still, Tesla has done incredibly well in battery technology ever since the company came into being. The first Tesla vehicles had a range of 256 miles back in 2012. This has increased to 400 miles for many new Tesla vehicles. While Tesla will be improving the range of all its vehicles during 2021, many are waiting for major breakthroughs like the announcement of a million-mile battery cell. It'll be interesting to see if Elon has a few surprises up his sleeves. Finally, let's talk a little about Tesla's expected valuation by the end of 2021. Tesla is already the most valuable car company in the world. It's more valuable than the next seven most valuable car manufacturers, including Toyota, Volkswagen, Daimler, NIO, BYD, General Motors, and BMW. Tesla has a market cap of around $650 billion. At the start of 2020, Tesla shares were trading at a price of around $84 per share. And as 2020 comes to an end, 
the price of Tesla shares are flirting with $700. This shows an increase of more than 800% in the company's share price. This trend is likely to continue as Tesla gears up to deliver more than a million vehicles during 2021. We can easily see Tesla becoming a trillion dollar company by the end of 2021. What do you guys think about Tesla's plans for 2021? Let us know by leaving a comment below. Also, make sure to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you can continue to watch such highly informative videos right here on Tech Charge. Thanks for watching.